Alright guys, so this is Terken playing Eden Eternal. I'm gonna show you how to do the Kimba Room run. It is a pretty difficult uh, room to run. Um, you need good gears for this run. Um, you can also have 100% evasion, um, so the mobs miss you all the time when they attack you. What you want to do is just grab the mob with, with your oil bomb. And you can also grab the witches at the back if you like and just, you know, keep on attacking them. Let your gears heal you when your HP is going low and just go in a circle, keep on attacking and, you know, attacking. Um, what you need is you need, obviously I'm using a staff, you know, good damage. And you need the awakened detour that will also give you HP if your, you know, your HP is going low. Just switch back and forth with the staff and the detour there. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you, you know, for newbie players or for people that want to try this run out or not sure what gears or what skills to use or how to do it. Um, what you need, of course, is 70% dark resistance. Really good gear for this run and just keep on going. Um, people do pay a lot for this run, 20k gold an hour, I believe, um, for this run. So it's a good way to make money, you know. But you can also, like I said before, have good gear. So, you know, just kill the mob, keep attacking them, let your gears heal you up. Okay, so when I first start this run out, I start with Light Blessing, which gives me Luck, Boost, Holy and Nature Resistance. Then I use Mark of Wind, which gives me Agility Boost and Luck Boost. Also with Goddess Blessing, which gives me Dark Resistance that I need to run this room. You need at least 70% dark resistance to run this room, or you're just gonna get one hit, two hit. Um, when I get them on, you know, when they're on my screen, I just grab the mobs and just use the other skills, like Oil Bomb, which stacks three times, and then Black Explosive, which gives them a triple hit damage, and Super Iron Man, which gives them extra boost, so it can go like, you know, double the hit so it's a good thing to have super iron man with you also i use focus it gives me more agility for my evasion and double hit rate by 15 percent and if your hp is going low i use aura hammer friend now that will you know help me survive this run so what you want to do in this run is um grab your staff and your awakened guitar and just switch them back and forth so if your HP is high just go to staff and just keep on hitting the mobs if your HP is going low switch back to the guitar and use it and it'll give you you know your HP back it will gen generate your HP back and that's what you want to do just switch back and forth with the guitar and staff there and you know at the end of the video I will show you what gears I'm using and um, what graphs and what KP points I'm using for this run. Um, this is my guide, my how to do it for, you know, for beginners. If you have another way to run it, you can use your way. It's just, you know, for other people, they're not quite sure what to do or don't know how to do it properly. I'm just giving them a beginner's guide. All right, so there you go.
Okay, so here's the last mob. He's going down. There we go. And I'm just going to show you all the gears or trophies, accessories I'm using. I'm using, you know, plus 14 gears, um, plus 14 staff, and you can use any gun you want. Um, I'm just using plus 14 gun. My accessories, trophies, um, necklace I'm using, and um, cape I'm using mostly have dark resistance. That's what you need for this run, 70% at least. My armor I'm using, light armor, with good evasion and damage, you know, for the magic class. Um, my magic attack, my evasion defense there. The boost I'm using to run this, um, you know, the stones, what pets I'm using. Uh, pretty standard and simple, you know, to get. And I'm just going to show you also the skills. There you go. What I'm doing or what I'm using for this particular run. It is a hard room, like I said. Um, it's just a beginner's guide, like I said before. And I'm just going to show you my KP points and my certificate I'm using. My certificate is mostly evasion certificate. Because, you know, you want to get the mob to miss you when they try to attack you. That's what you want. Good evasion. And uh, let's see, if I can go to my graph. Where is it? Oh, that's not it. Graph, graph. There we go. Okay, so mostly evasion graphs. Um, agility graphs. A little bit damage, critical damage there graph also. Just, you know, just look at it. See what you want or see what you need. And if you have any questions, just, you know comment. I'll answer as best as I can. And this is Tarek N signing off.